Hi yogis, I'm Victoria. I'm so excited you'll be joining me in today's yoga class on behalf of Whetstone. You're not gonna need any props for today's class, but if you like to sit on a blanket or a pillow for support, go ahead and grab one of those. You're gonna notice throughout class that I'm gonna switch from a more forward facing position to a side profile orientation just for clarity. No need for you to switch orientations on your mat unless I specifically direct you to do so. All right, let's get going. All right, we are gonna get started in a seated position. Whatever, whatever is comfortable, you're welcome to slide a blanket or a pillow underneath your bottom. All right, just rest your hands down on your lap, on your thighs, go ahead and close your eyes if that feels okay. Take a big inhale through the nose and exhale out the mouth. Again, inhale through the nose. Exhale out. Feel your shoulders start to drop down your back. One more slow inhale. Feel your chest rise up. Easy exhale. Feel your chest sink down. Shoulders down your back. Go ahead and blink your eyes open. Take an inhale, sweep your arms out to the side and all the way up. Exhale, bend your elbows out to the side and tick tock over towards the left. Pull your left elbow down towards the ground, right elbow up towards the sky. Good, come back through center on your inhale. Exhale, tick tock over towards the right. Right elbow down, left elbow up. Inhale, come back through center. Exhale, we twist. Twist over towards the left. Pull your left elbow back and your right elbow towards the sidewall. Pause here for a second. Feel the backs of your knees, your outer knees relax down towards the ground. And I want you to feel like you're pulling the left side of your body back and the right side of your body towards the sidewall. Feel this work maybe in your obliques, maybe across your shoulders and your upper back. One more inhale here. Exhale, unwind back through center. Nicely done. Take an inhale here, open the elbows up. Exhale, we twist over towards the right. Pause. Feel the work across your shoulders and your upper back. Good, unwind back through center. Inhale, reach your arms up. With the breath, exhale, elbows out to the side, tick tock over towards the left. Inhale, back through center. Exhale, we twist over towards the left. Inhale, unwind through center, reach the arms up. Exhale, elbows out to the side, tick tock over towards the right. Inhale, back through center. Exhale, twist towards the right. Feel the muscles in your upper back. Inhale, unwind, reach the arms up. Exhale, arms come down. Place your hands, your palms on your thighs. Go take an inhale, pull your chest forward. Feel your lower back arch. Exhale, round back. Drop your chin toward your chest. Feel your whole back round. Again, inhale, pull the chest forward, maybe eyes close. Exhale, round back. Slowing the breath down one more time. Inhale, come forward. Feel your whole back arch. Exhale, feel your whole back round. Good, inhale, come into a neutral spine, seated upright, and then exhale, we'll roll on over to hands and knees. If you were sitting on a blanket or a pillow, just sweep it off to the side. Good. Spread your fingers out wide, tabletop, shoulders come right over your wrists, hips come over your knees. Good, take one cat cow here, inhale, lift the tailbone, drop the belly down, push the chest forward. Exhale, drop your chin towards your chest, round your whole back. Feel your shoulder blades spread apart. Okay, inhale, come into a neutral spine here. A nice flat back. Keep your right leg where it is. Left leg kicks straight back behind you. Flex your left foot so your left toes are pointed down. And take a second to peek back at your left toes. Make sure they're pointed down. Your low back should feel nice and flat like a dinner table, okay? Left, right palm, left palm is gonna stay where it is. Reach your right arm forward. 
let your right thumb point up, right pinky finger down. Okay, now right where your hand and your foot are, I want you to lift up one inch. So your right hand, your left leg, lift up an inch, inhale, exhale, they lower an inch. Four more of those, inhale up, exhale down. Keep your nice flat back, inhale up, belly strong, exhale down. One more up, inhale, down, inhale. I think just one more for five, inhale up, exhale down. Good, keep your left leg lifted, bring your right palm down. Take an inhale, I want you to shift forward so your shoulders come over your fingertips. Exhale, bend your elbows straight back, tap your chin onto the mat. Inhale, straight arms, press yourself straight back up. Exhale, left knee down, sit your butt back towards your heels, take a child's pose. Let your forehead either rest on your mat or stack your palms, let your forehead rest on your palms. Close your eyes, take a deep breath in, Slow breath out. And up and over to the other side, reach your arms forward, come up tabletop position. Right knee is gonna stay, left knee is gonna stay where it is, right leg sweeps back behind you. Right toes pointed down. Maybe bring one palm to your low back. Keep yourself honest, make sure it's nice and flat, pulling your belly button up so that your low back isn't overarched here. Left arm reaches forward. Five little lifts, inhale up, exhale down, just an inch. Inhale up, don't let your low back over arch, exhale down. Three more, inhale, exhale. Inhale up, exhale down. One more, inhale, lift up, exhale down. Pause, keep your right leg lifted, left palm comes down. Inhale, shift forward, shoulders over fingertips. Exhale, bend the elbows straight back, tap your chin. Inhale, straight arms, press yourself up. Exhale, right knee down, sit back, child's pose. If your shoulders need a break, sweep your arms down alongside your body. Let your forehead rest. Take an inhale here. Slow exhale. Good, look forward, reach your arms forward, and we're gonna slither all the way down onto our bellies here. Good, come all the way down, kinda like you're setting yourself up for cobra. Point your toes back behind you. Reach your arms down alongside your body, thumbs pointed down, pinky fingers up towards the ceiling. And on your inhale, lift your pinky fingers up, lift your forehead, maybe your chest. Keep your neck nice and long, so maybe gaze stays down on your mat. Press the tops of your feet down onto the mat. Feel that firm up your quads. Take an inhale here. And then exhale, drop your arms down. Drop your forehead down. Feel your shoulders round forward. Relax your legs. Inhale. And exhale. One more time. Pinky fingers up towards the ceiling, thumbs down, point your toes, inhale, lift the arms, lift the forehead, lift the chest. Maybe this time you stay or you lift your heels up towards the ceiling too. Feel your quads firm like you're pointing your toes towards the wall behind you. Big inhale, lift up, exhale, fold down. Bend your elbows up towards the ceiling, palms come on your mat just about underneath your shoulders, Tuck your toes back behind you. Just press yourself back into a child's pose briefly for one breath. Close your eyes. Relax your face, relax your jaw. And then let's meet in a downward facing dog. Whenever you are ready, palms down, tuck the toes, bring your hips up and back. Shake your head out no or yes. Release any tension in your neck. Pedal out your feet, sway your hips side to side. Please know it's always totally fine to keep a nice big bend in your knees. Maybe feet are nice and wide towards the edges of your mat. Take an inhale here. And then exhale, walk your feet to your hands at the top of your mat for a standing forward fold. Feet are about hip width distance apart. 
bending your knees, let your head hang, feel your back round. And inhale, let this work come from your glutes and your hamstrings. So start to squeeze your glutes back behind you. That's what lifts you halfway up, hands to shins or your thighs. Back is nice and flat, shoulders down the back. And then exhale, fold, relax all those muscles on the back side of your legs. Again, inhale, half lift, hamstrings, glutes working, gaze stays down, exhale, fold. This time we rise with the flat back inhale, sweep the arms out to the side and all the way up to stand. This is one inhale to get up. Good, exhale, right arm stays where it is. Left arm comes down towards your left outer thigh, reach up and over towards the left. Inhale, come back up, left arm up. Switch it out, exhale, right hand down, reach up and over towards the right. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, chair pose, bend the knees, sit your butt back, chest comes forward. Okay, I want you to bring your hands to your lower back for a second. Just be mindful if it's overarched or rounded here. See if you can get your shoulders and your hips in one nice line here. Little bit of firmness in your belly button. I also want you to think like you're trying to bring your inner arches of your feet and your inner knees to squeeze together without physically moving them. So feel all that work in your inner legs. Take a big inhale here and exhale, fold, head down, tailbone up. Half lift, inhale. Exhale, your fingertips plant down, step your right foot all the way back behind you. Lower your right knee down onto the ground and inhale, sweep your arms forward and up for a low lunge. Big inhale here. Exhale, reach your right arm forward and your left arm back behind you. Twist open towards your left leg. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, sweep your arms down, back behind you. Lean your chest forward, just like your upper body's in chair pose. Tuck your right toes back behind you and lift up your right knee. Your gaze is down about six inches in front of your left big toe. Okay, let's move with the breath. Inhale, tap your right knee down, sweep your arms down, forward and up. Exhale, sweep your arms back, lift your back knee. Inhale, lower the knee, chest up. Exhale, back. One more inhale. Back knee lowers, arms lift up. Exhale, sweep the arms back, pause here. Your back knee is gonna stay lifted. Reach your arms forward and up for a high lunge. Nicely done, take a big inhale here. Exhale, bring your thump, thumbs together right in front of your sternum bone. Left leg stays right where it is. Right foot steps forward for a chair pose at the top of your mat. Good. Take an inhale, reach the arms up. Maybe heels lift up, we're on our tippy toes, pause. So right now it's more important to hug your inner arches together, hug your inner ankles together, inner knees, inner thighs. Breathe, relax your face, relax your jaw, big inhale here. Exhale, press to stand, thumbs together in front of your sternum bone. Good, take a second to shake out the legs. Roll the ankles. And when you're ready, inhale, sweep the arms out and up. Exhale, forward fold. Half lift, inhale. Exhale, plant the palms, left foot stays, right foot steps all the way. No, right foot stays, left foot steps all the way back. Good, lower your back knee down and inhale, sweep your arms forward and up for a low lunge. Big inhale here. Exhale, left arm forward, right arm sweeps back behind you, twist open towards your right. Inhale, unwind back through center. Exhale, arm sweep back behind you, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee up. I want you to think a sense of chair pose in your upper body. With the breath, inhale, back knee lowers, arm sweep forward and up. 
Exhale, sweep back. Inhale forward. Exhale back. Front leg is strong. One more inhale. Exhale, sweep back. Pause. Your back knee stays lifted. Reach your arms forward and up for a high lunge here. Take a big inhale. Exhale, palms together in front of your sternum bone. Right leg stays strong exactly where it is. Slowly, left foot steps forward. Chair pose. Feel your inner thighs, inner ankles hug together. Breathe. Lift the heels up. Little pulses here. Down an inch, up an inch. Down and up. Hug the inner ankles together. It's okay if you feel your ankles quivering, rolling, quads might be burning. Breathe. Slow inhales. Easy exhale. Stay with me. Lift your heels up, up, up. Right on your tippy toes. Slow the breath. Relax the face, even as the lower body is working. For five, for four, three, two and one heels down arms sweep out and up big inhale exhale palms together roll the ankles shake the legs maybe a twist side to side let your body release tension in the shoulders wherever you hold it the jaw the corners of the eyes nicely done top of the mat when you are ready Inhale, sweep the arms out and up. Exhale, fold. Half lift on your inhale. Exhale, plant the palms down. Step it back to downward facing dog. Check to make sure your hands are about shoulder width distance, maybe a little wider here. As we inhale, we glide forward into plank pose, upward push-up position, pause right here. Shoulders are just over your wrists. Firm the quads, press the backs of your knees up towards the ceiling. Imagine that line connecting your shoulders, hips, and heels. Align your body on this line. If that's not possible, your knees come down for support. Take an inhale here. Maybe knees come down as you exhale, bend the elbows, lower yourself with that nice flat back all the way down onto your belly. <laughs> Point the toes back, inhale for cobra pose. Palms stay down, forehead and chest lift. Exhale, lower back down. Tuck your toes back behind you. You have a choice to either press up into tabletop or straight into plank. Take an inhale here, decide which one, and as you exhale, press your palms down, we lift up and then we meet in downward facing dog. Pedal out the legs, shake out the head. Take a slow inhale, slow exhale. The inhale, your left leg up towards the sky. Exhale, step your left foot through between your hands. Right palm stays down, inhale, left fingertips up towards the ceiling, pause. Want you to look back at your left hip. Notice if it's popping out, hug it in towards your body. Left arm up, take a big inhale here. Now as you exhale, start to pull your left fingertips up so much that your right fingertips float off of your mat. Breathe, slowly, legs are steady, there's no rush here want you to rise all the way up straight into a twisted high crescent lunge. Good, pause, take your time, pull your left fingertips towards that space behind you. Feel that work in your upper shoulders, take a big inhale. Exhale, thumbs tongue come together in front of your sternum bone, we unwind into a high crescent lunge. Take an inhale here. Hey, exhale, your back knee starts to bend to hover, 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 about an inch, half an inch above the ground, okay? Here's our pulses. We go up an inch and down, up and down. We're only going up an inch and then down just to hover 
right above our mat. Feel this work in your front glute, your front quad. Breathe. Even here, I want you to think of that chair pose where the inner ankles, inner thighs are moving towards each other. Feel the work in your inner legs. Stay with me for five, for four, three, two, and one. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, we step it forward for chair pose. Right foot meets left at the top of your mat. Inhale here. Exhale, thumbs together, lift the heels up, pause. Move your shoulders back so they stack right over your hips. Breathe, lift the heels. Take an inhale here. Exhale, we slide our back down an invisible wall behind us. Don't rush it. Inner ankles together. All the way down. Drop the heels down onto your mat. Drop your butt down onto your mat. Feet stay out in front of you. Hands can come behind you on your mat. At an angle, we lift the feet. Boat pose. Okay, so again, just like in chair pose, that nice line, shoulders down to the hips. Hands can stay here or hands can come forward. Breathe. Hug, hug, hug. Inner knees together. Inner ankles together. Stay with me. If this ever feels like too much, feet come back down for support. Close the eyes if you can. Steady breath. Relax your jaw. Notice where you're tensing in your face, in your body. One more inhale here. Good. Exhale, feet down. Roll onto your back. Bring your arms down alongside your body. Knees pointed up towards the ceiling. Feet about hip width distance apart. Just stretch out the front of your hips. Inhale, lift your hips up towards the sky. Inflate your belly and your chest with big inhales. Slow exhales, one more breath here. Awesome, awesome work. Lower your hips back down onto the ground. Okay, slowly, arms reach forward, lift yourself up. We do this slow with as little momentum as possible, but there's always an option to bring your fingers onto the ground for support. Feet stay planted, about hip width, maybe a little wider, okay? Toes are forward, butt comes up, so we're on the heels. Heels come up, so we're on the tippy toes. Shoulders come over your hips. We're reversing that elevator chair pose. Thumbs in front of your sternum bone. We start to rise, slide your back up the wall. all the way to standing heels come down big stretch interlace your fingers reach up towards the ceiling maybe tick tock or twist side to side <sighs> check in with your body again relax your face your jaw corners of the eyes awesome when you are ready take an inhale stretch the fingertips up and exhale, fold all the way down. Half lift on your inhale. Exhale, plant the palms, step it back, downward facing dog. You either stay here and wait for us, or on your inhale, you glide forward for a vinyasa, plank pose. Exhale, lower all the way down. Through your back bend on your inhale. Exhale, lower all the way back down to the ground. Tuck your toes, decide tabletop or plank, inhale. Exhale, here we go, press yourself up. Downward facing dog. Big breath in. Exhale out your mouth. Here we go, right side. Inhale, right leg lifts up and back. Exhale, step between your hands. Left palm stays down, inhale, right arm out to the side and up. Reach your right fingertips up so much that your left fingertips start to hover. And rise all the way up into that twisted high lunge. Pull your right fingertips back, take an inhale. 
Good, exhale, come back through center, high lunge. Hands can stay up, hands can come to your hips or your sternum bone. Back knee hovers about an inch above the ground. Here we go with the pulses. Up an inch, down an inch. We stay really, really low to the ground. Let your front leg do the work. Press your right foot down into the ground. Press the ball of your left foot down into the ground. Even when the low body is working, we feel this challenge. See if you can relax the shoulders. Relax the face, the jaw. For five, for four, three, two, one. You got it, arms up, inhale. Step it forward, chair pose, exhale. Good, inhale, thumbs together, heels lift up. You know where we're going, stay with me. Shoulders over your hips, slide your back down against that wall, all the way down. Nicely done, heels come down, butt comes down, boat pose. Hold your boat pose. Thumbs come in front of your sternum bone. Inhale here. Exhale, twist just your upper body towards the left. Through center, inhale. Exhale towards the right. Center, inhale. Left, exhale. Center, inhale. Right, exhale. Boat pose, inhale. Stretch your fingertips forward. Good, exhale, feet come down. We peel our way up just like we did before. Glue your feet onto the ground, butt comes up, as little momentum as possible. Heels come up. Hug the inner ankles together, inner knees. Thumbs in front of your sternum bone, shoulders over hips. Slowly rise, do not rush through it. Let your body work through the discomfort. Keep your breath slow and steady, even as your legs shake all the way up take a big inhale here good exhale drop your arms down alongside your body hands to hips sway it out side to side awesome work shake your ankles out slow the breath down you can keep moving or find stillness maybe close your eyes bring your palms over your heart As you slow your breath down, relax your shoulders down your back. Start to feel your heart beating underneath your palms. Slow down. As you take full inhales. Big exhales. One more breath here. Relax the corners of your eyes. Inhale and exhale nicely done on your inhale open your eyes sweep your arms out and all the way up take a big inhale here fold all the way down as you exhale half lift inhale exhale step back downward facing dog you are welcome to stay in down dog or we move through vinyasa on your inhale glide forward exhale lower down through your back bend as you inhale. Exhale back down. Tuck the toes, inhale. Exhale, you press up tabletop or plank, downward facing dog. Everybody shake out your head yes and no. Pedal out your feet. Nice work, one more breath. Walk your feet to the middle of your mat and walk your hands back. So we're meeting right in the middle of the mat in a standing forward fold. Half lift, inhale. Fold, exhale. Let the arms be heavy. Let the head be heavy. As long as this doesn't tug or pinch in your low back, slowly roll up. Stacking your spine. Stretching out your back. Keep a nice bend in your knees as you roll up. 
Eventually you'll find that your shoulders stack, your neck, and finally your head. Good, take an inhale, shrug the shoulders up towards the ears, and exhale down your back. All right, turn to face one long edge of your mat. Step your feet out wide, reach your arms out to the side. Your feet should be just about the distance of your hands, more or less. Okay, turn your toes out, turn your knees out so they're angled towards the upper corners of your mat. Bend your knees as your hips come down. Just like in that elevator chair pose, your shoulders are just about over your hips here. Bring your hands to your outer thighs, press your outer thighs into your hands. You should feel that work right in these outer hip muscles. Maybe a stretch in your inner thighs. Adjust your stance so it feels comfortable. Knees just about over the ankles. Go ahead, pause here. Reach your arms out to the side. Bend the elbows, bring your hands behind your head. Take an inhale here. Exhale, we twist over towards the left. Elbows stay nice and wide. Lower body, legs don't change. Inhale, back through center. Exhale, we twist to the right. Inhale through center. Exhale, left elbow down, right elbow up, tick-tock. Inhale through center. Exhale, tick-tock over towards the right. Through center, inhale. Good, exhale, arms up. Straighten out the legs. Turn your left toes to face forward, right toes to face the short edge of your mat, warrior two. Good. Flip the right palm to face up. Flip the left palm to face up. Reverse your warrior, inhale. Exhale, warrior two. Reach forward, pull your torso forward. Right palm stays up, right arm stays exactly where it is. Left arm reaches up, maybe up and over, like you're holding a beach ball or a pillow between your hands. Check to make sure your chest is open towards me, shoulders stacked right on top of each other. Feel your obliques do this work. Keep the bend in your right knee. Inhale here. Exhale, left arm up. Warrior two. Hands to hips. Straighten out the right leg. Switch it out. Left toes towards the short edge of your mat. Bend into your left knee. Warrior two. Both palms flip up. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Palms stay up. Pull your left fingertips forward. Right arm up. Maybe you stay or right arm up and over, hold a beach ball. Check down at your left knee. Make sure your left knee isn't knocking in towards the center, but staying pointed in the same direction, more or less as your left toes. Inhale, exhale, warrior two. Hands to hips, straighten out your left leg. Turn all 10 toes to face the short edge of your mat. Fold forward. Hands slide down towards your ankles. Nod your head out no. Yes, a bend in your knees if you like. Feel your background, feel your breath start to slow. Focus your breath on something, focus your mind on something you're doing now. Slow breaths, sensations in your hamstrings, the backs of your legs, one more breath here. Good, inhale, half lift, hands to shins or thighs. Reach your arms out to the side with a flat back rise all the way up to stand. Nicely done, hands to hips. Step your feet together, walk towards the front of your mat. Inhale, stretch the arms out and up. Exhale, fold. Half lift, inhale. Exhale, step it back, downward facing dog. One last little bit of standing poses here. Inhale, left leg up to the sky. Exhale, step through between your hands. Right palm stays down. Inhale, left arm out and up, open twist. Exhale, right fingertips start to hover. Rise all the way up for your open twist, high lunge. Inhale, unwind back through center, high lunge. Exhale, palms come together right in front of your sternum bone, pause. Your left leg is gonna stay standing. We're gonna come up to standing, hugging the right knee in towards the chest. Take an inhale. Exhale, come onto your right tippy toes. Lift the right toes 
and slowly hug your right knee in towards your chest. Left leg comes to straight. Now notice shoulders right over hips, right over your left ankle. Pause here. Lift the right knee up, up, up towards the ceiling. You're welcome to stay or kick your right foot forward. If you're doing this, notice if you start to lean back, notice if you start to bend in your left knee. Standing leg nice and straight. Big inhale here, reach the arms up. Maybe pause, maybe stay, or as you exhale, left arm forward, right arm back behind you. We twist open towards that lifted leg. Inhale, unwind back through center. Exhale, thumbs together, right foot down, forward fold all the way. Half lift, inhale. Exhale, plant the palms, step it back, downward facing dog. Maybe you stay, or inhale, we glide forward, plank pose. Exhale, lower down. Through your back bend, inhale. Exhale, back down. Inhale, tuck your toes. Exhale, lift up, tabletop or plank, and then downward facing dog. Shake your head out now, one breath here, inhale. Exhale. Right leg up and back, inhale. Exhale, step between your hands. Left palm stays down, inhale, right arm out to the side and up. Exhale, start to hover your left fingertips, rise all the way up into your twisted high lunge. Inhale, unwind through center. Exhale, thumbs come to your sternum bone, standing leg, right leg is standing, come onto your left tippy toes. No jumping, no rushing, slowly stand, left knee in towards your chest. Good, breathe, lift the left knee up, right leg is nice and strong, press your right foot down into the mat. Maybe left leg kicks forward, arms up, inhale. Stay here or twist, right arm forward, left arm back, twist open towards the left, stay with me, right leg strong. Inhale, unwind, exhale, thumbs together, left foot down. Good, roll the ankles, slow the breath. Inhale, sweep the arms out and up. Fold, exhale. Half lift, inhale. Exhale, plant the palms, step it back. Downward facing dog. This is your last vinyasa of the class to take or leave. If you're with me, inhale into plank pose. Exhale, lower down. Through your back bend, inhale. And exhale back to lower. Stay strong. Tuck your toes. Inhale. This is it. Exhale. Press up. Nice and strong. Downward facing dog. Nicely done. You have about five breaths in down dog, child's pose, or a seated position. Wherever you are, see if you can close your eyes. Little movements are fine, maybe swaying side to side. If you're in child's pose, maybe rolling the head side to side. Relax the corners of your eyes, relax your jaw. Notice as you take deep inhales and slow exhales, how your heart rate responds, how it slows down. See if you can let your body get heavy somewhere. Relax the jaw. One more breath. Good. Blink your eyes open. Slowly make your way into tabletop position, hands and knees. Keep your left knee where it is. Right foot steps forward to the outside of your right hand. Angle your right knees and your right toes out for a gentle lizard pose. You can stay here, you can shift your hips forward. You're welcome to lower your forearms down onto the ground or onto a blanket or pillow. If, it, this, if this feels good, just stay here. Maybe roll to the pinky edge of your right foot Letting your right foot flop open, your right knee fall open. 
gentle sway of the hips side to side. You might feel nice here. Just continue to slow the breath down. Notice where the thoughts go. If they're starting to wander off, bring your thoughts back to where you are, to slowing of your breath or a sensation in your body, right outer hip maybe. One more breath here. Good, and then a really wide, gentle half split. Your hips just pull back, walk your fingertips back. Your right leg is still angled out to the side. Curl your right toes back towards your nose, press your right heel forward. You're always welcome to keep a bend in your right knee here. Chest pulls forward, tailbone pulls back behind you. And then walk your hands forward, bend into your right knee. Right knee swoops back next to your left. And we could do the other side. Left foot steps forward to the outside of your left hand. Toes and knee angled out, lizard pose. Hips come forward, maybe. Forearms are welcome to lower down. Maybe rolling to the pinky edge of your left foot. Swaying your hips side to side. If it feels okay, close your eyes. Taking your focus out of whatever is happening around you, whatever needs to get done. And staying with me, let's practice presence, focusing on the breath, focusing on what you're experiencing right now in your body. Slowly make your way into that wide-legged half split. If you're on your forearms, press your palms down, walk your fingertips back as you straighten out your left leg any amount, curling your left toes towards your nose. Good. Walk your hands forward, bend into your left knee, swoop your left knee back, tabletop position. Good, and come into a comfortable seated position, maybe kneeling just like this, or sitting on your pillow, a blanket, a crisscross, whatever is going to feel good for you right now. And inhale, arms sweep out and up. Exhale, fold forward. Let your back round if that feels okay. Let your head just hang. Maybe nod your head out no. Feel the stretch along the back, along your back. Stay folded forward. Just walk yourself over towards the right. So you're in a right-sided forward fold. Feel the stretch come into the left side of your body. Walk your hands back through center, eyes are closed. Crawl your hands over towards the left. Feel the stretch come into the right side of your body here. Back through center and slowly walk your hands back in so you're seated upright. Wherever you're gonna take your last pose, of today's class, go ahead and make your way there. I'm gonna stay seated. You're welcome to join me or maybe lay down onto your back, wherever you're gonna be comfortable. Settle in. Start to close your eyes. Let your arms drop down alongside your body, or palms in your lap. Just go through your facial muscles for a second with me, forehead relaxed, corners of the eyes, jaw. Move down to your neck. Feel your shoulders not lifted, but not plugging or pressing, just naturally where they fall. Fingers naturally curled. Take a deep breath in through the nose. Slow breath out. Thank yourself for doing this work for tuning in just for a little less than an hour, giving yourself the time and space to move, to check in with the breath, the body. And one more inhale with me. 
and a smooth exhale. You're welcome to stay here for longer. Your life's slowly opening your eyes. Thank you so much for joining me.